Hello and welcome to Indian Wells Let's Play of Ultima 6, The False Prophet. Uh, there's been some stops and starts on my initial foray into the land of Britannia. We tried to start with U5 Lazarus, but uh, have had several crashes, and uh, we're hoping this one works out a little better for now. And here we go. Oh, and to thy name. Not Ultima 5. We'll do an x-ray. Yeah, although that is a badass portrait right there. Hey, if you want to be a chick. No. I mean, yes, of course, but not, no. <laughs> Flowing blonde Fabio locks. Man, really? And I guess as flowing blonde as you're going to get. Why is the black dude's head so much bigger than everybody else's? See it? It's like body, his head is like 20% larger compared to his body and everything else. I, 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 are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got nothing. <laughs> Ultima 6? Yes. yes. I don't know, know what Kingdom of Ebb is. <laughs> well, I remember the Dungeon Siege intro mentioned the Kingdom of Ebb, so that must be what it is. Oh, really? Yeah. I haven't tested this. Attempting to enter <laughs> Yeah. Britannia. This has not been tested. Since I was not allowed to test this one. It's not allowed. Well, you could have. Just not with me around. So you have a nice picture of the Avatar killing a gargoyle. You have a cool Aunt Key. Oh, yeah, nice. And... <laughs> what? That's me. Wow. It didn't start with any, like, words this time. N nothing. Goodness. All right, um... Maybe that's our gypsy over there. Now, luckily, you pretty much figured out a lot of these controls when we were playing two and a half hours of Lazarus <laughs> before we decided Maybe. all the crashes were just too much for Whoa, us Oh, this right is some now. new stuff. I get a journal? No. Uh, All your hotkeys are up there. I yeah, assume. Yeah, hopefully the they're the same. What's yeah. this right here? Events console. Ah, interesting. <laughs> Let me check out my items. I ain't got shit. You got an unk. And I got 30 food. Oh, no, no. I got Orb of the Moons and a torch. Right. Oh, I really hope that this oh. remake of Ultima 6 doesn't have the crazy lighting restrictions oh, that Ultima Jesus. 6 did. Yeah, we tried to do the Ooh. regular Ultima 6, which we might end up having to do. We may, yeah. But, uh, might anyway. Eventually. After all, um... Rustic Dragon Valer Valerius? Vitralis. Vitralis. I always call it, just call him Joseph. Vitralis oh, yeah. was awesome enough to give us, uh, all of the Ultima games, so yes. eventually we will be playing all of them, except maybe some of the really early ones, but it'll be fun. Also, again, I do want to say we have promised no walkthroughs. Yes. We will pinky swear again here live. Ready? Ready? You can't see it. Oh, <laughs> pinky swear is happening. Okay. A small wizened woman frowns up at you. She peers deeply into your eyes and then breaks into a smile. What's your name, woman? What one calleth oneself is not nearly so vital as what others address thee by. Most call me the gypsy woman. And your job? To aid thee in knowing thyself. Knowing thyself? Ancient wisdom speaketh that one may know himself through the mystical gods. Dost thou wish a reading? Nope, sorry, going back home. <laughs> yes, I do. The gypsy falls silent as she solemnly deals out the cards for your reading. Oh. Ah, alright. Questions! <clears throat> thou art sworn to protect thy lord at any cost, yet thou knowest he hath committed a crime. Authority is asked thee of the affair. Dost thou break thine oath by honestly speaking, or uphold honor by silently keeping thine oath? Yeah, we're going with honor. Going with honor? Fuck the pigs. <laughs> Although a teacher of music, thou art a skillful wrestler. Ultimate <laughs> warrior! No, no, real wrestler, oh, no. not that fake stuff. Thou hast been asked Rulon to... Rulon Gardner, there's my wrestling shadow guy. <laughs> Who is the crazy Croat cop dude? Croat cop? Croat cop. 
Oh, he wasn't really a wrestler, He's though. He's not really a wrestler. He's famous for his kicks. Oh, okay. Thou hast been asked to fight in a local championship. Dost thou humbly decline, knowing thou art sure to win, or accept the invitation and valiantly fight to win? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Go for valiant? Yeah. Okay. Thou hast been taught to preserve all life as sacred. A man lieth fatally stung by a venomous serpent, and he pleadeth for a merciful death. I didn't agree with this one last one last time either. It's like, pull out some anti-venom, suck out the poison, although I know that doesn't work. You know, something. Show compassion and end his pain, or heed thy spiritual beliefs and refuse. I don't know. They're both I terrible I would show options. compassion and end his pain. Ah, uh, fair. We'll go with that. During a pitched battle, thou dost see a fellow desert his post, endangering many. As he fleeth, he is set upon by several enemies. Dost thou say, screw that guy, he ran away. Yeah, just, just leave, let him fight alone. Really? Yeah. Sure, Walker. Thou dost manage to disarm thy mortal enemy in a duel. He is at thy mercy, mortal enemy. I slay him. Slay. slay. Thou hast sworn to do thy lord's bidding in all. He coveteth a piece of land, and ordereth the owner removed. Dost thou serve justice, refusing to act, thus being disgraced, or honor thine oath and unfairly evict the landowner? Oh! Yeah, serve justice. justice. <clears throat> thou hast been sent to secure a needed treaty with a distant lord. Thy host is agreeable to the proposal, but insulteth thy country at dinner. Dost thou valiantly bear the slurs? Or justly rise and demand an apology. Man, this was rough too. I would try to come back with <coughs> another smart ass quip that makes me look good and makes him look dumb without actually insulting him. Ah uh, That's a lie. You would just insult him. Or punch him, you know. I'm saying I would insult him smartly. Well I don't think you'd care if you came off as insulting though. I'm also if I'm uh, fucking securing a treaty from a distant land. Yeah. Um just leave. Well, first of all, if he's going to enter in a treaty with your country, your country needs to be, you know, strong, mm -hmm. seen as strong. I would justly rise and demand an apology. He needs to learn his place. Right. You have bestowed, been bestowed with the wisdom and judgment of the druid. Is that bad? I don't think it's good. <laughs> Thou art finished here. Seek thee the ring of stones that call thee unto thy destiny. All right. Until our paths cross again. You like my old voice there, baby? I do. That's what I'm going to sound like in 50 years. <laughs> That's fine. This is the circle of stones in which you appeared. It now appears inactive. <clears throat> so, Drew, it's bad. What, um, did, what did we want? Paladin? Probably Paladin. <coughs> oh, my God. Strength 18. Well, strength 18, dexterity 20, intelligence 20. We're going to have to train the fuck out of some strength. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think it's good. Oh, well. It's what we got. Sure? We're going to play with it? Do it. Alright, I'm not really sure what to do here. Moonstone. Nothing happens. Click it. Click it. No? Nothing happens. Um. Does it say nothing happens? Yeah. Maybe you see it? Look. No. I went here. Yeah. Right click to use. Nothing, Nothing happens. happens. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, but this is where we're supposed to be, stupid gypsy lady. Ah, I'll keep following this path. But it's pretty. Yeah. I guess. Do we even have? We don't have like any kind of weapons though. We got Jack. Jack and shit. Like Maybe you should huh? save. Can you save? Don't use quick save. No. Where the fuck do I go? What the fuck, <laughs> what the fuck big? Alright. Aha! I found uh, another one. There's a serpent on this one. You see, this circle is mark of stones is marked with the symbol of the serpent, but appears inactive. Do you think we need this down here? Probably not. Ah, uh, I'll leave it on for a little bit, if that's cool. <laughs> fail. Nothing happens. Maybe that's from, no, Seven's not around here yet. <clears throat> Alright. I got one more path to fail. I thought 
it said to go back the way we came. I, I thought it did too. I could be doing something completely wrong. Once again, two hours at the Dungeon Seat Engine, <laughs> a master does not make. There we go. Uh, now it's time to GTFO. Oh, this circle of stones is marked with the symbol of the Codex. You see a shimmering red moon game. Isn't it not usually blue? Yeah, they're supposed to be blue. Reds are bad. Remember, we drew a red one for our thing because I said it was going between worlds and it wasn't working right. Oh, uh, yeah. It's all pretty and swirly. Swirly of death. I dig it. We are going to die. Well, we are probably going to die many, many times. Dazed, you emerge from the portal and find yourself amid hellish creatures. What? Oh, shit. Oh. What? What? Virtually defenseless, you fall quickly. I lied. Maybe we will die. <laughs> <clears throat> that seems unfair. Oh, shit. What's binding me? Upon waking, you find yourself magically bound. Eerie guttural chanting fills the air. Oh, I dig the chanting. Hold well on. Suddenly, you hear a burst of crackling energy. There's my boys. Oh, snap. Your companions burst through and the demons scatter. What? Scatter? Kill them. Iris bolt fells the daemon. There we go. A book spins from its grasp and Iris older seizes it. YOLO. YOLO. You are momentarily blinded by the burst of energy as Dupre slashes the bindings. Yeah, yeah. As your vision returns, you see Shermino disappear into the moon gate. Falling closely, you are transported. I'll do YOLO, but I'm still saying Shermino. I like Shermino. All right. However, something, something, we were talking. Sorry. That's okay. So it just has long load times. I, I, as long as the sword doesn't disappear, I think we're good. And Lazarus, it was just a black screen. Yeah. Can you still move the sword? Oh. No. <laughs> the sword disappeared. <laughs> oh, no. I hear it. I'm so scared. I hear sound. I'm so scared. You, Please don't crash. You Please. Jinx the Please. Fuck. Yay! <clears throat> well, hello. What? What is happening? Oh. oh, we don't get to do the initial fight. Oh. That's no good. What the heck is surrounding Lord oh, Bridge? No. Hey! Man, look at Lord British. He looks like an old Viking king or something. I thought he was supposed to look like Richard Garriott. That's Richard Garriott, what he looks like spiritually. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's his avatar. Yeah. Man, look, I'm even all fucked up, man. Mm. Whoa, what's that yellow thing by my bow? Okay. Lord British rises and speaks. Well done, companions. Once again, welcome once again to Britannia. With that, thy welcome was more appropriate, avatar. The wrinkles in Lord Bracia's brow seem to have deepened since we last saw him. It's good to see thee again. Much hath happened since thou didst depart our realm. The vast underworld from which thou didst once rescue me has collapsed. Yet still there are forces of evil abroad in the land. Britannia is under attack by gargoyles such as those thou hast just fought. They have been coming up through the dungeons. Thus far they have mainly attacking the shrines of the Eight Virtues. It appeareth that the gargoyles attacked the shrines, and then with foul purpose summoned thee to our land. They diverted thee upon thine arrival using magical treachery. Luckily, Nystal was able to sense thine arrival in this land, and I sent thy companions to aid thee. What, they summoned me? The Avatar? They summoned the Avatar? Weird. The gargoyles. Weird. Yeah. Is that why it was red? Yeah, they're going to kill you, <clears throat> man. Yeah, I don't think we need this down here. Nah, we can go there. <sighs> The portal used by the daemons has since been closed, and I cannot send my armies through to vanquish them, alas. Perhaps thou canst drive these vile creatures back into the bowels of the earth from whence they came. All our efforts thus far have availed us naught. Oh, shit! Wow, I actually have quests! Weird. Weird. I don't know if I like that or not, but we'll go with it. Okay. We're still keeping those. 
When the Shrine of Compassion did fall, Sir Geoffrey, my captain of the guard, sent a party to free it. Perhaps he can prove of some resistance to thee, but now the gargoyles may have captured more of our shrines. Thou must hurry, thou wouldst foil their evil schemes. Alright, you see your old time traveling companion, Geoffrey. Who's Geoffrey? Geoffrey? He's the head of the guard. Oh. I think he might have been with you in one of the offshoots. Huh. Like. I know Shimino Dupre and Yolo, that's it. Yeah. No, you know, Gweno. Oh, Gweno. I yeah. kind of know Julia. Yeah, yeah, sort of. And Petra. And, well, that's sort of. <laughs> I don't trust this mustachioed fool. <laughs> Yeah, he looks like, um, he looks exactly like fucking Magnum P.I. He so does. It's, it's right. motherfucking, all right, so our brother Magnum, Magnum P.I. I, I wish I knew Magnum P.I.'s voice, so I could do it. Yeah, I can't do it. Sorry. I'm glad to see thee, XJ. Perhaps thou can prevail where others could not. I sent a party of ten to recapture the Shrine of Compassion from the Gargoyles. Alas, they failed dismally. The survivors include the leader... Gerten and recuperating in the town of Cove, who is recuperating in the town of Cove. Cove. Thou would do well to speak with them before beginning thy journey. So first thing we should do is go to Cove. Got it. Mayhaps they line, learned of something which should aid thee. Probably the first thing we're going to do is get Lord Brace to heal us, and then we're going to go to the dungeons and see if they have a rubber duck. <laughs> okay. That's random. When thou art ready to take on thy foes, thou should return to me, and I shall send thee on thy way to leave the castle and free Britannia's beloved shrine of compassion. Hail to the XJ and well met. <laughs> Twas I who learned of thy peril through my mystic arts, so thou that aid might be sent unto thee. I saw that thou didst find a book. Might I examine it? Might. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Strange, this picture on its cover. Tis written in a language I know not. Take it to Mariah the Lyceum, the finest scribe on the great council of wizards. One more thing, Avatar. I noticed thou didst arrive through a red gateway. Dost thou have the stone that opened that gate? From whence could it have come? The gargoyles, perhaps? Thou shouldst best ask about British about it. I believe he hath some knowledge of such items. Hmm. I do have such a stone, as thou mayest recall. I did not know that there was more such orbs. To serve thee well in thy travels, if thou dost master its powers. To open a gate, use the stone, and focus on thy proper destination. That will need to have visited thy destination before it will work for thee. Oh, nice. We have a quick travel. Yeah. Okay, I think that's a little different. I think in six <coughs> I had to go with the phases of the moon. But they're probably working within the restraints of the... Mm. Could be complete one. Whilst thou art here, I have a room in the castle set aside for thy personal use. It is in the west wing of the castle, just south of my own chambers. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> we started we started Ultima Six, uh the true Ultima Six, not the remake, and uh we ended up robbing Lord British Blind, I'm robbing blind. and getting damaged by traps and wondering Shit. why Lord British would have trapped things he'd set aside <laughs> for us. I've had my servants place some equipment there in case thou should have need of it. Of course, thou should feel free to borrow anything if thou should need it. Except that which is protected <laughs> by slime traps. Lord Brace then reminds you of the virtues of the towns of Britannia, and you record them in your journal. Lastly, any time thou dost need healing, thou but has but to ask me. I need some healing. Mm-hmm. Dude, look at this pretty prism thing. Is that him? If I ever meet Richard Garriott, he'd better have one of those cool prism things around him. No, that's nice, though. Oh. That's Lord British. Oh. So I can't seem to... My request still stands. Oh, no. I didn't want to sit in his throne. <laughs> Ew. That's Come on, guys. <laughs> Seriously, everybody. Everybody come this way. Thank you. Heal me. Lord British waves his hands and your whole party is healed. Alright. Man, I look kind of drawn and weird. And... Eh, it's not too bad. You don't like it? It's like a yeah, pastel it's, thing. It's alright. Your fortune favorite. Okay. No, we... I mean drawn as in like sunken. Sunken and emo slightly. Journal. Wow. Whoa. Restore the eight shrines of Britannia. Restore the shrine of compassion. Strange book. Take the strange book to Mariah and the Lyceum. All right. <clears throat> wow, this is kind of Ultima on easy mode. Yeah, right? Definitely don't need any walkthroughs, then. Yeah. No. Restore the shrine. Okay. Well, interesting. 
Mm. We'll mess with that later. I'm not too worried about it. Oh, uh, Chuckles. No Chuckles. I'm not going to talk to you right now. I'm going to check these guard bodies. So I got Chuckles. So let's, I, I, got, I got that. All right. Do we want to talk to them further? Well, actually, first and foremost, I got nothing. Yeah, let's go equip me. Actually, let's... Save? Yeah. Oh, uh, Will is a saving fool, so you're going to see the screen a whole lot. Saving fool. He should have used that right after Chuckles. Yeah, we'll talk to him on the way out. I'm also still not 100% custom to this thing. Alright, so British should... No, my room should be this way, if I can remember the castle. No, we don't have a map, so... Whoa. You should gather equipment and supplies. Yes. We know. Oh, man. This jury is not going to want us to wear a plate now. I think we should let him become a paladin, but... That's fine. We'll go with what you got. We will pay for it later. Ah. <laughs> Man, this one's awfully a lot more jumpy than the other one. Is it? That's not good. Yeah. Wait, isn't this my room? I think so. Why is there a chicken in your room? It's oh, got an all. Oh, yeah. Servant. Uh, She's in a bit of a hurry. All right. Spell book. Give me, give me, give me. Z. Nah, I'm just going to grab this stuff. I'm just reading up there. I don't like to skip through stuff. Uh, help. <laughs> is that to like? Sure. Is that to like? Uh, I don't know. What that access is. the help files. That's hilarious. Maybe. Food must be converted to rations in order to feed your party. Mm. Right click on the food item in your inventory. Wow. Okay. So we do still have to eat. I assume we still do have encumbrance. What's this? Now, is that shared among everybody? Is that I food think top? so. We'll check. Is everybody at 34 right now? I should be homeless. Uh, I'm getting shit Holy shivered. crap! Jesus Christ, Lord Almighty. Wow, books. Books. Maybe we'll do, we'll, we'll start saving some books, and maybe we'll just do a special book only where we read all the books. <laughs> no, we should read them as we go. Maybe not all of these, since they're... There's my pocket watch. I need that. Oh, there's my coffee. <laughs> right, I gotta figure out how I can convert these spells. Oh, who's YOLO? YOLO, you're my potion holder. Hold them potions, YOLO. You haven't looked to see what they have. I know. Is that my bedroll? Yeah, your bedroll. Yeah. Bed Trail rations. Trail rations. You can probably, can you Z to take everything? Um, take all. Oh, nice. I didn't want to take all. Well, then don't. Then don't do it anyway. <laughs> all right. Wow, dude. The irony? I didn't get any weapons. What's that? 12 arrows. 12 bolts. Bolts, really? Bolts. So I guess this one, I, apparently Lazarus didn't have. I get Chimino. The arrows. Gold down there. You need a gold mule. Oh, I think these are. Are those the previous games? I think they're all just the previous games. So it probably gives you hindsight on what all went. All right, I think really? last time. Yeah, we're oh, we need a sextant to see our uh, our uh, location. I wonder if that's what was why we couldn't do it in the last game either. A sexy sextant. Sexy. everything yes it did automatically take that oh it automatically took the rations too interesting and the gold check to see if everybody's <sighs> at 84 or if we've defeated individually no, yeah the same. 
That's a Jesus. Oh, wow. Jesus. Look at all this crazy stuff. <sighs> okay. I'm going to go ahead and pause the game here. Pause. We're going to do inventory, mm -hmm. and then we'll start back up. Actually, you know, we're at about 25 minutes. We can probably just go ahead and cut the first video here. Okay, we're going to cut the first video here, and then we will start up, and I got inventory all set. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. We will be back in the second video.